Ryu got some buffs in Season 1.5 and some new tech was discovered, so I'll be covering the new optimal routes and setups. Some of these small changes make a big difference, especially damage. Input captions are on screen and timestamps are below if you want to skip ahead, but let's get it, baby. This combo is a creative way to get more damage and also convert to super. I did find that this combo does not work if the opponent is too close to the corner or if you don't get the proper spacing with the combo, so be cautious when using this route. The opponent has to be somewhat mid-screen to get the right amount of spacing after the OD donkey kick. If you don't have level 3, you can still convert to level 1 if the opponent is high enough after the light hasho, or you can just do a regular DP. If you land a OD Hasho, you can dash forward and get a crashing hard punch to Hasho, sweep, and then get a Dejin charge. It leaves the opponent close enough so you don't lose that much space versus ending with a donkey kick, but it's not completely safe to character specific supers. Use this with caution. This isn't a new combo, but just a reminder that if you want to get Oki after the OD Dejin Hasho, dash forward once, then do standing hard punch to medium Tatsu. One of the new setups that was discovered is doing the light Hasho after the light Tatsu conversion. It leaves you at plus 2 frame advantage so you can continue your offense with throw, strike, or shimmy. After the roundhouse donkey kick to light DP conversion in the corner, whiff a crouching medium kick as soon as you land and it'll push you back far enough out of throw range. Now that you can safely frame trap with light Hasho, catching opponents pressing a button between your strengths can lead to a juggle state with extra damage. With the buff of OD Denjin Hasho, this is now the optimal route for corner damage without spinning all of your drive meter. This is more of a styling combo if you want to burn all of your drive meter and you're maxed out on your super bar. You'll have to manually time the charge level 2 just right for it to connect right before they hit the ground. If done correctly, the opponent will be in a rolling juggle state to get the rest of the combo off. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is AM and if you like this type of content, let me know in the comments below. Like, comment, subscribe. It really helps out the channel. Come join the community on Discord if you want to run some sets with me in the community. We have a very active Discord that's full of fighting game players and other people who just talk about life. If you want to learn how to play Ryu, I have a ton of Ryu guides on my YouTube and I'll also be making a new series for season 1.5 and eventually season 2 when it comes out with more changes. Anyways, that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. GG's and I'll see you later. Peace.